Let's go inside. Come on, girl. No, you're not sunbathing out here. You just want to sunbathe? You're funny. No, we gotta go back in, okay, honey? It's like really hot out. Come on, let's go back inside. Come on, girl. Don't lay down. No. Girl, what are you doing? <laughs> Although Riley fights me a little bit on her exercises, she's being a really good girl overall. She's doing really well in her little pen here. She doesn't seem to mind the pen at all. And she does wear the cone on her head, of course, when I'm not around because I do not want her to get to her incision at all. Um, but yeah, she doesn't seem to mind the pen. I just like to sit in here with her sometimes just to keep her company. I got my TV right there, so uh, I've been binge watching it stranger things but yeah she's doing pretty well overall let's see if we can get a little look at her incision um, the incision looks so good like she's getting her stitches out in four days oh you oh, don't like it oh you can't really see it too well but yeah the incision looks great so yeah overall so far so good I'm really super surprised. I did not think it would be this like easy, if you will, but it really hasn't been too bad going through the surgery with her. Um, she's doing so great. I'm so happy. Riley's using her injured leg to itch her ear. Scratch her ear. I'm not really sure if I should let her do that, to be honest, but it seems like a good thing to do. Like, she's using it her natural way. If you started scratching real fast, I guess I would probably stop her, but... I don't know. That was kind of good to see her using her leg in, like, a normal way she typically would. Good girl, honey. We're on day nine post-op, and Riley's doing really well. Riley... I have to do your exercises. Can you stand up and go on the other side? Come on. Stand up. Come on, girl. Stand up. Stand up, girl. Stand up. Or at least, yeah, move on the other side. <laughs> I'm going to get her to move so her injured leg is up. She has still been resisting a little bit when I try to do exercises, but I just, like, pat her. I often hold her like this so that she can't turn around. <laughs> yeah. See, she keeps trying to, like, lick her belly every time I... Every time I do her exercise, she tries to lick her belly. So I kind of hold her like this and be like, not let her lick 24-7. Riley actually had to get a toe amputated a little over a year ago. This is her left back leg. Same. Same as three toes. This one got amputated because there was actually a tumor growing out of the nail bed. Um, now that I'm documenting her TPLO surgery process, it kind of makes me wish I documented that process for like others who might be going through that. Um, so I might tell the story of it in a future video. Wanna go outside? Okay, let's go. Did the kitty venture into your pen? Yeah. She was saying hello.
Honey, it's okay, honey. You get all worked up. Oh my gosh. You're okay. Today is July 22nd. Bradley's doing really well. She went to her first physical therapy appointment today and now she's exhausted. She gets exhausted just by being in the car honestly because she gets herself like all worked up about it. She's just very anxious in the car but um, she did pretty well at the physical therapy. I was I was surprised. Um, she was a good girl. She did a good job with all the exercises they were showing me. So they also did the laser treatment on her leg. And she couldn't go into the underwater treadmill today because she, her stitches not, aren't out yet. She's actually getting her stitches out tomorrow. But she did all the exercises and they gave me a write-up of all the exercises I should do at home. So now I have like a good solid plan of what I'm going to do for her uh, recovery exercises so I'm happy about that um, and then I bought a package from them where she gets uh, six appointments and so now I set up all the appointments and she's going to go once a week and then I'm going to do all the at home ones myself so yeah it went pretty well and I'm so proud of her she was such a good girl now she really has to settle down because she's still a little worked up. We just got home just a little while ago. But um, next time we go to the physical therapy, she'll be able to do the underwater treadmill. And I'm very, very curious how she will react. So that appointment is actually in two weeks. So we'll see how she reacts. I'm definitely going to film it because I just really want to see her reaction. Um, I think she'll like it because she really likes water. But she's highly anxious, so I think she'll be very confused and, you know, anxious about what's going on. But yeah, overall, a good day. She did a good job at physical therapy. Good girl, Riley. Good girl. Now she just has to settle down for the night. Good girl. It's the morning of July 23rd. We just did all the exercises in the range of motion stretches that the physical therapist showed us yesterday and Riley was so good about it now I am icing her leg and we're getting ready in a little bit we're gonna go and get her stitches removed so it's a good day for her all right we just got home from the vet and Riley got her stitches out it went really well let's see if I can get a little look at her incision there you go. It looks great. And they gave her another week's worth of um, pain pills called Carprofen. Because um, I had asked for it because yesterday when I went to the physical therapist, they recommended that she should be on painkillers for at least the first three weeks of physical therapy. Um, just so she'd feel better and it would make her, it would make her put her injured leg down on the ground so I got a week's worth so we'll use that and see how she feels from there and I mean I'll call my regular vet if I feel like she needs any more but she's doing pretty well now she just has to settle down and I gotta head to work good girl Riley good girl oh yeah no more stitches means no more cone good girl you're done with the cone yeah, you handled the cone pretty well, but you're done with it. I promise. No more cone, okay, girlfriend? Yeah, good job, babe. You're such a good girl. Little sweetie pie. Good girl. No more cone. 